Hello my family, welcome again to Direct TV bringing to you the truth. Welcome guys to another special episode of my video. And in today's video, I am here with the man of God, the highest in Reverend Dr. Chris Oyakilume and the most and uh, one of the humble uh, men of God, uh, Prophet Lovey Elias. And in today's video, both of them are going to be talking on something very, very key and very, very important. There are a lot of Christians who doesn't really know about the aspect of talking, why they should talk as Christians. So in today's video, these two powerful men of God are going to dive into that particular aspect where Christians need to know or where the body of Christ need to wake up on. Even Apostle Michael Rocco even talk about it. Okay guys, um, before we, you know, dive into watching today's video guys, um, if this is your first time in my channel, please hit the subscribe button and subscribe to this video. And if you have not liked the video, please, before we continue, hit the like button and like today's video and also share this video. And then let's watch today's video on uh, Pastor Chris Oyakilome and Prophet Lovey Elias. But I'll be right back to introduce the man of God, Prophet Lovey Elias. Please watch the man of God, Pastor Chris, right now. Watch this. He was always talking. You are too quiet. Are you listening to me now? If you have found yourself in poverty, it's because you are not using your mouth right. If you found yourself in sickness, you are not using your mouth right. Are you hearing what I'm telling you now? You've got to learn to use your mouth. Your mouth was given to you, not for cursing people. Your mouth was given to you, not for eating and drinking. Your mouth was given to you to create your future, to create your life, to give yourself joy. Your mouth is your instrument of joy. Your mouth is your instrument of prosperity. Your mouth is your instrument of health. What you want in your life, you have to talk it. What changes you want in your life, you have to talk them. What you want to see in your family, you have to talk them. What you want to see in your body, you have to talk them. Are you hearing what I'm telling you tonight? Until you talk them, they will not show up. <laughs> Some people think that their life will change because they are praying. Keep praying. Prayer is good. I pray. Prayer helps you, energize your spirit, but you're not changing anything. There are different kinds of prayers. You have to understand the kind of prayer that changes things. Is the prayer we call praying the word. It means talking the word. It means putting the word in the situation you find yourself. Are you hearing me? It means traveling on the word. Are you hearing what I'm telling you? Flying with the wings of God's spirit on the word of God. There are many of you here. God is going to catapult you to the mountains of God. Where you're going to see things that you never knew existed. Are you hearing what I'm telling you tonight? Hallelujah. Wow. The word in my mouth. The word in my mouth has brought me hope. The word in my mouth is hope for my family. The word in my mouth is hope for my future. The word in my mouth. I'll never suffer in my life because the word is in my mouth. Are you there, somebody? This is the river of God walking. Go with a God. All right, my family. There you have it with the man of God, the Alice in Reverend Dr. Chris Oyakilume. Okay. Um. Like I said, I will be right back to introduce the man of God, Prophet Lovey. So we are going to be watching Prophet Lovey Elias right now. And something different that you are going to be hearing from Prophet Lovey, but it's still connected to this topic that you are going to be listening to now. So that's why I want you to pay attention so that you don't um, miss out on anything. But before we go ahead in watching Prophet Lovey again, please, I would like to remind, because some of you have still watched this video up to this point, but not even a like from you. That's not nice, please hit the like button and like to this video and if you have not yet subscribed this is your first time on my channel please hit the um subscribe button and subscribe and then watch this guys i'll be right back to share with you what has also blessed me and don't forget to leave a comment already on what is blessing you watch this guys the only way you can express your spirit in this physical world is by the expression of your vocal cords <laughs> wow. that is the only way you can reveal only not only your spirit but also your soul it is very easy for us to reveal our soul when somebody makes you angry you are ready to react when somebody insults you you are ready to react but when it comes to your spirit you don't react let somebody talk about you or you think you're all that 
I may be in Jesus, but you don't know where I came from. You start invoking the streets that you left. You start talking about your neighbor that was... You don't know what I did to that. You become uh, uh, David. You don't know what I did to those guys back in the day. You're not back in the day, but because they have triggered your flesh. Yeah. But when the devil touches your spirit, you do nothing. Demons are afraid of men and women that can express their spirit by the spirit of God. If you read scripture, when it came to Jesus casting out demons, the Bible always says this. With a stern voice, he commanded the evil spirits to leave. With a stern voice. Jesus never said, devil, now I'm Jesus, you know. You need to go. <laughs> up, up and away. Go. The Bible says with a stern voice. Say, who are you? Come out and never return. And the demon, notice, the expression of your spirit is even in the tone of your voice. How can you say, I am blessed and highly favored? I'm blessed and highly favored. You don't even believe it. Even your voice saying you're lying. How is everything? You know, God got me. You don't even believe what you said. It's not coming from your spirit. When something comes from your spirit, there is gladness. There is joy. It is empowered. Because you know at the mention of what you're going to say, something in your life is shifting. Something in your life is changing. Oh my God, guys, if you are not blessed by that message, it means there is something wrong with your spirit, guys. If you are not blessed with that message. Ah, my God, Prophet Love is really, 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 really amazing. I mean, oh God, I, I can't even start in talking today's video. All right, but before I, you know, share what has blessed me in today's video, guys, um, if this is your first time in my channel, all right, because some of you might want to step down, but if this is your first time in my channel, please hit the subscribe button and subscribe to this channel. And if this is your first time or you, you have not yet liked this video up to this point, please, you got to like the video. I mean, imagine hearing something like this. Wouldn't you like somebody else to also hear it? So hit the like button and like today's video so that this video can be recommended to other people. All right, guys, I know you are going to do that. Thank you so much. Okay, let me share what has actually blessed me. Starting from the man of God, I'm the highly esteemed Reverend Dr. Chris Oyakilume. Ah, my goodness. You, did, did, did you hear what uh, Reverend Chris said All right, about talking? The reason why you are struggling, the reason why you are still in poverty, the reason why you are not rich, the reason why you are not getting the money you want is because you are not talking the money forth. Ah, that's so amazing. All right. So what you got to do is that start talking. Your mouth was not given to you to eat. Start talking. Be talking the word, the realm of God. That's what I got. Pastor Chris is really amazing. And I was really blessed by the man of God, Reverend Dr. Chris Oyakilome. And for some of you um, that haven't done that, you got to do it. So Prophet Lovey also talked about the fact that the words you speak need to come out from your spirit and if they come out comes out from your spirit they carry power all right so if you speak the word of god from your spirit man you can do anything you can do and undo so i am very sure that today's message has blessed you and i really know that you would love to come back to watch some of my videos again so what i'd like you to do is like subscribe to my channel and then like this video and do well to leave a comment on what has blessed you guys. Do well to leave a comment. What did you hear that blessed you in today's video? I would really like to hear. So um, leave a comment in today's video. Alright guys. And check out others of my videos in this channel. And I will see you in my next video guys. Bye.